This is Sparta! Hello everybody and welcome back to World of Tanks. My name is Spartan Elite 43 and tonight we've got a two-part double feature to go along with the Battle Axe double feature. Because sometimes you gotta do a double take of a double feature. Now this one we're in the M55 Tornado and we're gonna be on steps in the first one and we're gonna be on Serene Coast maybe? South Coast? I think it's South Coast. Anyway, first map's first. We're on steps. Good news is it's not a st it's not a sandstorm. That's awesome. So I spawn in the south. I'm going to go to my little sniper perch, and we're going to shoot from there. Um, we've got two arties. They've got three arties. I like to take that as a uh, challenge to outdo their entire team's artillery fire. Uh, sometimes I counter battery, though most of the time I don't. Um, personally, I feel that I can outplay most people in their artillery, so I generally don't feel the need to counter battery, even though my team would probably prefer it at times. But all of these tanks spotted, just begging for it. We've got hammer tanks. We've got all kinds of squishies, just waiting for the tornado to drop some nukes. So, without further ado, let's get that first shot out of the barrel. Shot out. Pow! 896. There goes two-thirds of his health, and he is just sitting there begging to die. CDC, if you sit there, I will paddle you. I promise. <laughs> T29? No, T... Yeah. Yeah, I think it's T29. It's hard to see. <laughs> like I've said before, if, you, if I ever misquote a tank, it's not because I don't know what the tank is, it's because... When I'm doing this, I'm in Windows Movie Maker, believe it or not. And the render is in low low quality. So you don't really get to see very well. It's kind of standard definition and all that good stuff. So it's hard to make out some of the intric intricacies uh, that I normally would do. But, uh, but yeah, I'm pretty sure that was a T-29. And we see shots being fired. Oh, T-95, you squishy tank. Shot out. Pow! 1,470 damage. Go back to the garage, sunshine. And my team just lost their mind. Because they saw a T-95 and crapped themselves. Then they saw the T-95 become the first death of the team immediately. <laughs> so, they know that they got an Artie on their team. And he does I. Shot out on the RHM. Oh, game. How can you deny me that? I know you just let me paddle the uh, T-95, but come on. That was a perfectly placed shot that you just dirted into the ground that would have absolutely annihilated that, that Borsig. But, you know, there's always the next shot, right? Get ready. Get ready, because here I come. Shot out. Pow! 244. Second kill of the game. Not bad. All right, so right off the bat, we notice that the left side is thin and they're moving in, which means I need to give them some help. Now, the teams are even. Two down on both sides. CDC, you've moved up, my friend. Let me help you with that. Nope, he runs away. Eh, you know, it's a thing. Oh, T-54E1 or T-26E4. Shot out. And we overshoot by a mile. That is definitely... I'm going to say it's a T-26E4, Super Pershing. CDC's right where I can hit him, and then he disappears. <laughs> Go figure. Now, they're requesting fire across the map, but because these guys are where they're at, I have to focus on this left. I cannot support those guys. And those guys pushed out way too soon. Oh, we got a Type 59. Never mind, we don't have a Type 59. Our team seems to be pulling this back slightly. Slightly. <laughs> Not by much. Oh, hello. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I seem to missed 
a shot again. I placed the shot exactly where I needed. The game made me miss because it repeated. I don't know. I'm going to quit ad-libbing a song and focus on trying to shoot these people. I haven't sang in a video in a while, so you guys, you know you missed it. Oh, CDC, do I take the shot? Come on, shot out. Pow! We hit, but it was most likely a splash because had it actually hit him, he would be dead. So, we'll take that one with a grain of salt. Oh, T-29 gets set on fire and is dead. CDC is now half health, so yes, it was indeed a splash. T-26, E-4. Come on. We've got a heavy tank, looks like a fatherland moving up behind. He hits him for 424, and he's about to turn. Shot out, and we overshoot by a mile again. Come on. And for those of you who are watching who are going to say something along the lines of, well, the reason you're missing these shots is because your tank is, your M55 is on uneven ground. All right, I've been playing a long time with this tank, and I will tell you this. There is absolutely no truth to the fact that if you're on uneven ground, you miss more shots. None whatsoever. Um, I've hit people with stupid, like, traversed stupid uh, angles on my tank, and I've hit people, or missed people, when on perfect ground. So, it's, it's, that has nothing to do with it. It has more to do with the ground that you're, oh, nice shot. Goodbye, Brazil. We save the AT-15 for a little bit longer. But, in the end, it doesn't even matter. We tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, I don't even have a round loaded. So I try to ram him and then get sniped. It happens. I really wanted to ram that CDC. It's a shame that somebody had to shoot me first. <laughs> what do we end up with 3500 damage three kills and look at those potatoes folks i'm fairly confident we need to call up hers and uh, donate some of these potatoes to uh, the potato chip company <laughs> that's that's a rough game man only three of us broke a thousand damage that's rough but anyway moving on to the next match <laughs> south coast i was close I think I got it South Coast, right? Of course, I think I said Serene Coast first. But either way, South Coast, we spawned in the South, so that means I'm going to J3, J4. And we're going to sit on top of that hill to my left. You see, I'm already looking at it. So, we are alone, and we just... I'm not the biggest fan of this map, but it's not a bad map. It really isn't. There's a lot of camping going on on this map usually. So you you've got to position yourself to take advantage of most of the map. The spot that you can get into right here uh, allows you to target most of the map. It gets you above a lot of the smaller hills so that you can hit shots you normally would not be able to. Um, but that being said, the, the heaviest camping spot on the map is right there at C7. And unfortunately we can't oh wizzy shot out or vicky it's a vickers 28 and we splash him for half his health good luck getting out of there without getting killed anyway yeah i'm literally gonna just keep looking right at him because he cannot escape without being spotted and if he stays there i'm gonna splash him again and probably kill him this time so wait for it yep he's still there and Shot out, and we overshoot and land in a puddle because it's a rain map. Go figure. Eight inches of pain landing in a puddle does absolutely nothing to a tier six light tank. Yeah, that's a thing. It's definitely a thing. Anyway, Motherland is calling my name. Come on. And shot out. And we get a nice little splash of 257. Not a huge hit, but enough to at least let him know that he can't sit there. Sometimes it's all about influencing where the bad guys feel comfortable. And if you can stop people from feeling comfortable, you can win the match. 
just on psycho uh, psychology alone. T32 rolling up. He's got this. Shot out. Pow! 784. Not bad. Half his health. He's tracked right in front of our team. Are they going to finish him off? Doesn't look like it. IS3 rolls up. Kills our dude. E50 sitting there. Centurion 7-1. T32. Like, there's so many tanks camping in the open. And I've got people cruising up on my right. So I've got to try to finish a couple of these guys. Shot out on the IS3. Pow! 469. We splashed off his backside. And we don't get the kill. It's a shame, because he was broadside on to an 8-inch howitzer. But, come on, E50. Nope. Come on. There you go. Go right back to where I can shoot you. You're fine. You'll be fine. What could possibly happen to you? Oh, you're broadside on. Dear Lord, let this hit. Shot out. Oh, come on. Really? I hit the building and splashed him. That's wrong. That's so wrong. T-54E1 rolls up, clutches, kills two of the enemy, and then it's killed by the E-50. Now, the E-50 may have screwed up and gotten stuck. It looks like he's stuck, guys, which means even if he disappears, I'm pulling the trigger. Guess what? Shot out. Pow! 868, our first kill of the game. Six hits so far, and the right is completely collapsed, which means we're about to be engaged from our flank. And that means I'm going to have to, uh, eventually turn around. Come on, Centurion 7-1. Can I get loaded and attack him before I get shot in the butt? That is the question. And shot out. Pow! 704. He's tracked right in front of him. He fixes his track, gets around. I've just fired, and now there's a there is an IS to my right. Now, the IS, I believe, still can get the 122. Can't remember perfectly, but I, I think that's the one where you get the 122 for the first time. So we've got to make sure that he doesn't shoot us. He could potentially one-shot us. Now, we're aimed fully in, and shot out, and we miss. Really, game? Really? So, I bug out. I use my ramp, bug out, try to get down below ground before they can shoot me. And I managed to survive. Now, the main thing here is to get to a defensible position where I will have the advantage. Now, the problem is I was spotted and didn't realize it at the time that I was spotted and all the way to my new honey hole. So he knows exactly where I'm at and I'm going to make a key mistake. I don't look far enough left. So he's going to be able to come around the corner and end me before I can pull the trigger. Oh, no. Yep game over it's unfortunate but we end up with seven hits and a kill we'll and unfortunately our team wasn't very good what do we get 37 45 and one kill two losses in a row second on the leaderboard to a cromwell with absolutely no damage explain that one so if you like what i'm doing punch that like button leave a comment below subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and as always i will see you in the next video